Some of the challenges that we have here is due to the, uh, the immigration issues. We, we have a lot more traffic coming through, uh, foot traffic and it's vehicle traffic. One of the things that impacts us the most are is human smuggling that comes through here. Uh, they, they have a uh, disregard for life, it seems like, as they come through and they're stopped by DPS or Border Patrol, their first instinct is to try to get away. So as they're coming through here with bodies inside the vehicle, they'll drive recklessly and very dangerously through the city. So the great part is that we work good with DPS and we have a great relationship with Border Patrol and we work as one. We try to take care of the community and try to protect the border. But these are some of the things that impact us. That's one of the more dangerous ones and will sometimes uh, lose uh, migrants and people that are coming through because of that, because they'll flip the cars or they'll wreck the cars. For the most part, a lot of people are honest that are coming through and looking for a better way of life, but there is always still that bad element. When I first got here was right when they had the uh, Haitians crisis that was under the bridge where was very publicized. Uh, that was something where a lot of people came over right away. Since then, we've had influxes like that, but now it seems that Customs and Border Patrol is, is uh, prepared and working together with all of us, we're, we're able to, to handle it better. Border Patrol, I know, is uh, doing the best they can with the people they have, but uh, they can obviously use more help. It's a large, large area, and sometimes they've just got a few agents per hundred you know, plus miles to, to watch that. They do have some pretty good technology, but with the processing, it takes so long to process and to get all these through, it takes a lot of their agents. And I know that that's something that they're really, they're wanting. They've asked us to, to pitch in and to transport and things of that nature, you know, here and there, and everybody will do the best they can when they get inundated. But for the most part, just more manpower for Border Patrol, I think would be one of the major things that would help over here.